And here, big man, mean you could put on a better show than this kid. On, mm. he went. Why don't you tell that to dog? <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on. I just... Welcome to a pint and two shots, coming to you from the G4 podcast studio with part-time pundit and average actor Stephen Purden, and bringing a wealth of knowledge and questionable patter. It's our no-nonsense dafty Chris Toll. Completing our front three, it's the man himself. All the way from the tap end of Stevenson, it's Grado! Welcome to a Pint and Two Shots, it's a podcast, it's a football podcast. We're live here at the J4 Clem Studios in Wishaw. Shell suit, Bob, Toe and the Champ Champ here once again to talk all things Scottish football. No, no, no. <laughs> no. Would you rather fight one Mike Tyson-sized me? Or one me-sized Mike Tyson. One you-sized Mike Tyson. No. What? No, no. I'd rather fight... What? Say that again. Right, would you rather fight one Mike Tyson-sized me? So me, the Aye. same size as Mike Tyson, Mike Tyson. Or would you rather fight Mike Tyson that's the same size as me? Mike Tyson that's the size Aye. of you, man. Aye, definitely. So? Aye. 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 Fuck you. Aye. You've been dying to do that for years, haven't you? <laughs> why, why do you hate, why do you hate Tom, man? <laughs> <You know? laughs> You guys get a missus? I know, take a bone. I know, I've swore already, man, it's annoying. Have you swore already? That's what I'm saying. Aye, aye, aye. we need to stop the cursing. Right. I know, Once I can, again, I can we're, going, we're going through a no swearing face. I know, I know you will say, but honestly, I hate, last week we stepped out of the podcast and I swore it away. Aye, it's not just Sneak that as well, we're, just to the, no, just to the no. six-year-old but, tell but, us. Aye, in front, in front of Grant's daughter, you swore and then swore again when you said sorry, then when you realised you swore again, you swore again. <laughs> And she said that we are the swearing men. I ah, you swearing men. We need to get after that, mm-hmm. man. Granko had a t-shirt with us, mate. Do you know these guys? And the, the, the way men. Oh, that's the swearing guys. That's swearing guys. That's already. That is already. But oh. to be fair, it's not a child's podcast, so it's bad parenting as well. Mm. <laughs> I mean, watch his podcast, man. Well. Nah. Does he, honestly? Leo loves it. Him and his pals, man. Because they're obsessed with YouTube and it always pops oh. up. And they're like, oh, let's put a on with them when you start talking about Just me. Some... What I mean, what I mean, he's more got up to in a first name, man. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Uh, exactly. Uh, it's, it's amazing bad, that man. he brought that up this time, isn't it? <laughs> oh, he's so did. <laughs> <laughs> and anyway, we're recording on a Thursday, so I know what's happening after the podcast. Oh, oh, oh stop, uh, don't, don't go down that road. Right, don't go down sorry. that road. I know, it doesn't put pressure on me, doesn't it? I don't. It doesn't put pressure on me, it puts pressure on Nicola. Aye. Aye. <laughs> pressure to perform? Aye. Cause then no, <laughs> no. no, the funny looks on a Friday morning. Aye, because she works with people listening to the podcast. That's right. It's, it's, no, it's, it's, no, it's no nice. No, it's no nice, man. Talk about your birds. <laughs> ah, my bird gets talk a, about all the time, man. He, uh, he, I, I'm, I'm a wee bit fear of Stephanie. Because she's an adult. I know, she's, she's an actual adult. real adult. <laughs> no, do you know what's funny, man? I always think of Stephanie. Mm. Like when we're driving home, we're drossing it. You were trying to get my motor. Mm. See when like he phones her or she phones him, it's like he's talking to his moss or something, man. She's put like, what is it, Graham? <laughs> He gets in like a different mode. It's like, all right, uh, how's it been? Is she all right? Aye, she's like, aye, Graham, what, what's wrong? That was like, that was like when the police were following us. Aye, he, he was trying to be funny on the phone. Instead, was like, right, what is it? Aye, I was like, oh, oof. I was at a day, but because she, I, I softened the both of you, you because she likes talking to me. Man. I had a good banter. Aye, aye, she, good. she pure changed when I was like that. When she realised I'm in the motor with Graham, mm-hmm. what I mean, she was like, all right, how you doing? I love the way she was like, all right, Bob. <laughs> That's your alright, Bob. She maybe just doesn't like me. Uh, no, she does. So she... I don't think she because because she knows you called her world. Eh? Remember that? Aye, that was only that was only so to become pals with you. Mm. Mate, that's... <laughs> <laughs> Mate, that Kratos bad man. Oh, you're a world. Nobody wants his serious talk about. Bob. Everybody wants to hear me world. and you talk about how shit Rangers are. <sighs> oh, <sorry. sighs> Aye. So we're recording on a Thursday, and Rangers have just Getting been beat. defeated. <laughs> Of a team who are like six in the separate league. Okay, Irish uh, like Marsos or something. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I thought we weren't going to switch. Literally, uh, one segment later. I know, I know, I know, I know. No, nah, we get beat too. To be fair, that was funny. <laughs> That is like funny, man. But you were <laughs> being beaten by Aris Limassol. See, see it again. So far, I've Aris Limassol. You're getting all kinky when you're saying Aris <laughs> Limassol. Aris, because he's been away in Europe this season already. <laughs> <laughs> he's eyeing it up. Can you get them in the next round of the Challenge Cup, Listen, then, guys? Winning away in Europe isn't for everybody. Oh. Sorry. Well, by the way, winning in Europe isn't for everybody. Actually, slated a fanatic fan. <laughs> <laughs> That's how bad it's got. An Aki's fan is Gino's abuse. Where are you sitting in your league again? Top. Well, joint top. He's a second. Joint top. He's a second. By the way, 
they're not you, even they're not even just like yeah. joint top. No, they they are. and Falkirk are about fifteen points aye, ahead. Aye. 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 I said to Tony Tol- Motor, right? See this weekend. See if Hearts and Hibs win. I don't know who they're playing yet. We'll get to that in two pictures. No, if Hearts and Hibs win. And sit Mirren. Well, they can't be if one because they're playing each other. Is Hearts and Hibs playing each other? <laughs> aye, aye. Oh, that, that's good for us then. We'll be, if sit Mirren beat us, get it in an international break, we could be like fifth or something. Yeah, it's, it's torture. Like we, because yeah. we obviously are watching that, that European game there. What's the hell? You're not the fixtures every week. So <laughs> every <laughs> I know. And I can, in your league, after Falkirk and Hamilton, I'm sure it's. Another team, then it's like Queen of the South, then still in Albion or sitting fifth or sixth or something like that. Are you still playing Falkirk off, this weekend? Way. So we're playing Falkirk Saturday night, BBC Alba half five kickoff, top yeah. of the table clash. Yeah. And, un- and unless we draw, an unbeaten is it record Falkirk? will be taken, yes. Yeah, you just got to get pumped. Jink? Aye. I was, on, I was on John's podcast during the week. Uh, you'll be rolling about the flare wheel. Aye, man. Saturday. John can find John scrapping outside, by the way. Bringing that, stadium, if, by the way. If he's bringing that level, Jess, can you get a little trick? <laughs> no, he gave that back to Bowie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. He just thought it cleaned and hold it back. Just hope he doesn't turn up with the young team. Here, see, just a quick one on that. We've been getting, me and my mates have been getting messages Fate like fourteen year old guys to Falkirk going, you scrap me the weekend. Right? <laughs> you, you to right? So my mates are going. Now nah, he's getting the bus straight to the stadium. He's messaging back. What are you doing, man? Pure scared to catch one night in on that. You better watch you don't get the wolf pack. Let's come here, or something. <laughs> it's like I'm a water. Way. It's like a water done diluted version of the football factor, isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah. The Aki's in the uh-huh. the Aki's in the bell, man. <laughs> We're going swimming. This, uh, <laughs> We're only going swimming. Trust me. I'm not Peter. I'll get you inside Starbucks. <laughs> There's an Aki fan who knows a guy for Lazio, and he's, he's a guy for Lazio. He's trying to get for Lazio. He's, 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 that's right next to Wraith. Uh, he's, he's trying to get some of the Lazio fans that are still in Scotland to come to the game for honours. <laughs> <laughs> he's gone for Rome and getting half in Kirkcaldy. <laughs> oh my god, man! Much shambles, but anyway, will we talk about Rangers? No, let's talk about you. What you been up to? What right. you been up to, man? Been doing the telly. Just the telly gear on, man. <laughs> Well, walking in, right? He gets, he gets out the motor. See, every time Grado is doing something that's on the telly, it's like when your dad's got the one suit for going to a funeral and going to a wedding. <laughs> He's always wearing the trousers and the white jeans. He should do him for three new years ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Last yeah. time I saw him, they were on a couch with Ginger Hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm doing that again, so. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's my go-to. You know when he's doing the but, telly, man, when he gets out with his strides and he's on. It's because it's the first, it's because the first series of Scotland's Greatest Escape. I was not literally turning up my track <laughs> and, and it was a, a new producer of this series, and he's like, he's like, I, was, I watched the first series. He's like, I, you're standing there wearing like a tracky tap and a pair of tracky you're the presenter. <laughs> so every day he's messaging the director, going, "How does Gradle look today? Is he had a wash? Is he? Is he shaving? Is he had a wash? And I'm not joking. I'm not joking. They're quite. He's every day he's checking up. So I've just got these. What are you about the beard? Well, right with that. And he needs trimmed down again. So Aye, he's, mate. It's day man. I don't know. I'm mean, going to walk with Julie's having a nightmare. Oh, I thought you were talking about mine. Oh, no, I love your beard, man. Uh, sure. And you look sexy, man. You look pure affronted there when he said that. No, mate. You know what? I like beards, man. Aye, Aye. I much prefer having a beard, man. It's oh, a lot Aye. easier, man, to keep I wouldn't hang about with the, great, the fresh face grade one. I know. The way you wouldn't hang about with me before I got my hair transplant. Oh, man. I remember I bumped into you one time. With but we you know watching something in the motor last week, the Pavilion of Dreams. Makes me sick when I see you all tied. I can't even take it serious. No, he always goes like, oh, man, when he sees it, it's like, he actually gets disgusted. He, looks, he, he sees me, see me popping up in that wee documentary, and he's like, oh, man. he's driving, going, <laughs> he's like, ah, no long until you need to face it every day. I know, tell me about it. But, Panto. Panto's no, but my hair's better now, man, it's like my hair. I, he I thought he was talking about the beard. No, 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 no. He can be alright with the beard because we're. Beard's alright. You don't know what we're talking about, don't you? You're talking about before you get transplanted. Ah, you wouldn't hang about me. The same way I don't. You're a little Jake Ball. I can't have any defence. I actually agree with him. <laughs> Would you ever get in and told for your head? No, sure. They asked me if. They asked me if ah, I you got to offer that. Remember? Oh, oh, that's right. Right. Mate, you would look cool with a tattoo on the beard, man. Kid, no, mate. And then I'd need to shave my head every day, or I would have a tattoo on the top. And I have a hair pie. If you're Larry <laughs> David, do my not man with a tattoo. Could, but could you shave it then? If you've got a tattoo, can you shave it? No, no, no. It's, no, a, it's only like. Uh, <laughs> It would be the sides. That would. So right. you would have a tattoo. I think you'd like the sides of it. Daddy Devito. 
<laughs> That's why Crofty's, Crofty's got to shave his head like every other day. Sure, the first time day. I met Crofty, right, I walked into the, the Go Radio studios. Uh, it was what, when we were allowed to cuddle folk again, remember? Like, oh, that was funny. Hangway. So I came in, the first thing he said to me is, Chris, why don't you get this done? I went, like, no, you're all right, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I, guess, but I, I, was, I was watching to see when I was doing dancing, remember? Aye. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Maybe better clarify. I know. Well, dance. Well, then ballroom dancing for charity. But he, he, I can see I, I was. I, I was looking fair across the hall because he had his hat off, yeah. and I thought, ah, actually, it looks spot on. It does look like he's got him on the oil. I know. I would. I would definitely be doing something like. That. How did you Why? do it? Cause you look nah. cool. I don't get me. No, I, I don't give a fuck. You still you look know cool. That. I know you don't. To be fair, he's no vain like us. I don't give a fuck. You know what I mean? I, I was told that I was going bald when I was fourteen at high school. And I went down the God, down that the must hairdressers. Have been tough, man. <laughs> <laughs> mate, mate, I just felt like that. That's all you needed at fourteen, man. <laughs> you didn't know me at fourteen, mate. I was I was the king of the hill. <laughs> right, but hang me, I've I went down to the hairdressers that day. <laughs> Listen to this gimp, man. <laughs> Sorry. We don't, we don't. We don't go to school, he's never killed him, man. He's here, it's fucking funny. My demoxinal. <laughs> Rubbing my demoxinal into my scalp. <laughs> because... Caffey <laughs> shop. Ring, ring, ring. Because he's a king of the hill, man. Nobody can see anything, man. Oh, don't, don't mention his hair. Don't don't mention, see see whatever you do. Don't mention this. I can see you in the school bag with a jacket, man. Oh, do you know what happened? Genuinely, oh, right? I went. I was in art class, and one of the boys came up. One of the boys came up to me. One of the boys came up to me and went like, "You're starting to go bald." And I went like, "No, I'm not." And I went home and I checked, and I went down and get my head shaved, and I'm not all over, and I've had that ever since. No, but you suit your bald head, but I but, you, aye. Aye, but that's because you, that's how you know me. You know you. Aye, aye, aye. aye. Better be speaking. <laughs> Somebody called me a gimp, right? Because I said I was talking about how I wanted to do the post. I saw the, the comment on YouTube. Aye. Oh my God, Grado, you gimp, want to be a postman? But then somebody went like that and said, said something else to kind of back me up. Mm. But this person that called me a gimp went, eh, "It's you are Ken with the, with the apostrophe," aye, and aye. it's the first time in my life I've ever wanted to go. Who's that fucking gimp now? But if you're grammar, the, the grammar man, police, know what I mean? Aye. He's wanted to be a postman. He's aye, a gimp. He's, he's going, eh, "It's you, not you." Oh, I hate people. So I've been wanting to graph my chest for the last six days. You are. I think you'll find that that's a contraction. It's you are. You are. Don't listen to me. That's the worst thing you do. Read the comments. Don't read the comments. I mean, you are a gimp doing that job. But I want to be fair. <laughs> Did you see the one the boy put in the Discord today? No. Community no. Warden umbrella. He's like, I find Grado's umbrella. <laughs> put, it in the, put it in the Discord. Mate, I, my, my pals took my Community Warden gear to Tina Park now. I wore it to see the original person. That's not official council Community Warden. That's hilarious. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, oh man. Do we need to talk about that bonnet? It's a good laugh. I don't know. Talk. What else have we been doing? Eh, uh, what that day at the weekend? What that day? What that day? What that day? Oh, I had a, a good wee baby in Salt tonight. Aye, on the Aye. Eve. Yeah? I watched the, the first season of Crime. Because Aye. I'm, oh, first season mate. of Crime's good, man. It's good. Do oh, hey. you like it? Mate, I thought the first episode was Oh, trying. right, aye, right, 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 right. This, this is funny. This is funny, right? This is funny, right? So, we were talking about this all day, going, how are we going to talk about this in the podcast, aren't we? Aye. Right, so, the park, right, so one day, I got an addition for Crime, right? You know this story, anyway. Mm. I went down. It was a, an in-person edition, which is unheard of. Very these unusual days. these days. So I goes down to St Andrews Square, right down to Edinburgh, goes in, reads the edition, and I'm like, ah, was fine, the woman's like, ah, do you know what, I've got another part for you, right? So I'm like, right, okay, right, it was like the wee informant guy, the wee Jake, Jake Paul, <laughs> like the way I used yeah. to look, right? So I was like, all right, I need more, so I done it, so I'm like, great, man, <laughs> blah, 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 so I comes out, and me and Nicola went, we went out that day. And you saw in Edinburgh? I were in Edinburgh. I stayed in Edinburgh that day. We went to Portobello Beach, right? Sweet. And I text him. No, he texts me or I text him. I can't remember. I was like, just had an addition. No, right, man. I went for Dexy and crime. No. So we started voice noting. We started voice noting the dialogue. The lines. Not right, man. But then cut to in here. I don't know if you remember it. I get an email, right, from my agent saying, they've got something for you. They want you to... I think it's the informant part, mm -hmm. right? So I came in pure buzzing, man. Go, oh, man I've got, oh, I've got, I've got something for me. Day. They've got something for me, man. They've got, you held back in. He's like, I got a part. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, good, mate. Aye. And me and him always wind each other up and go, if something good happens to me, he's jealous and vice versa. So I was like, 
Hvad skal det mand? Hvad skal det? Så der er nogle dem stående i skøre i, og bare gik sådan med mig til de skal bare. Hvor står kræmmerne sin? Bare 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 tage ved nogle. Hej, skal det mand? Og så i vent det juno, der synes jeg mig. Nej, jeg vil så ah ah ja, der synes jeg mig. Jeg så ah ah, jeg siger der er bare ting. Godt fire i gæt af partner, jeg siger sådan noget. Kred du godt? So I watched Crime. Aye. Did you not like it? I thought the first episode was brilliant and then it just went, it, it was just too formulaic, to be honest with you. But I, I watched, watched season two and I hope it's... I just fast forwarded to my bit. <laughs> I did. You're not even in season one, aren't you? No, no, no it's two. Season, season two. Two. I'm, I've not watched season two yet. He fast forwards to the part I didn't get. So, what is it? Because he's a, he's a drug addict. And he's a, he's ref- an alcoholic uh, drug addict mm. uh, detective. I thought it was good, mate. I liked it. I, I don't know. I think You're a tough critic, but mate. I know, but I, I really like Irvin Welsh stuff, mm-hmm. usually. So it, I was quite surprised. It's not your running him out. It's, no, it's a bit, bit. You can see Beg being him. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. The way, the way. Don't get me wrong. The great Scott's excellent. Isn't it? Oh, he's phenomenal. It? it was good to bone set with somebody like him. Man, yeah. he, mate, he, see him, but man, he's he's got an aura. But uh, you know, he was meant to play Wolverine. Is it? And Henry, uh, Hugh Jackman. He got, he got recalled for Mission Impossible Two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he couldn't do it, and Hugh Jackman got it. And look now. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Big mm-hmm. Hibs fan, man. Slide, yeah. Sliding doors, mate. Mm-hmm. Exactly. It was good. It was good. Good to talk to. I was talking to him at the football. Ah, I killed me. Ah, so what else? Yeah, could you not? Could you not get him on? Yeah, could you not get him on the show? No. Eh, no. Was that because that was last year? It was a bit last year, wasn't it? Degree. We could get him on Easter Road. I don't know if they agree with Dara. I think he stays in Hollywood. Ah, he's big time. Does he? Me, he's big time. Ah, he's wandering on it. No, man. Because he's what a hips fan. How does he get to the games? Kill me. You're better than that. Oh, leave me alone. You're better than that, man. Leave me alone, it's too late. I should be in my bed. I know. <laughs> it's 10 to 9 for, for flip's sake. Oh. Well, let's just not keep shining a light on it. Aye, aye, okay. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, aye. Though, so, you, you, you missed something quite big about the weekend that you, that you did that you've not told us about. Oh, aye, the Home Improvement Awards. <laughs> <laughs> what about you talking about for? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I just thought that would be a funny, a funny thing to mention. Well, aye, Crofty okay. Crofty can make me a Aye, well, aye, as I say, me and Crofty have never done any sort of hosting before. I always think mm. that's, that's, that's a skill to do that. Got a story about that. Um, and he was like, this, earlier on in the year he goes, do you want to host some improvement? I goes, that's not really, I goes, well, it could be quite hard to do. He's like, we'll just do it. I was like, right now, so I've been kind of worrying about it all year. <laughs> well, I have, because that's, you see, that's like Des cut there all. And no, you have no idea how but, much anxiety but, stuff that causes you, but man, oh, you know, you're actually not enjoying a weekend before because you think what I'm going to be doing the following weekend. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then, uh, so, the night before I was in the sky and I was like, I need to get in because I'm hosting these awards and more about Crofty. Can see it far enough. And then I, I wakes up the next day and Crofty's like, I've got a faint line. 
all retro COVID test. I can't do it. He's pure dug out of the bin, hasn't he, man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> no, he's put that in the tap drawer. Now you always keep him as a garbage in your tap drawer in the kitchen. He's kept that for somebody doesn't want to date. Aye. I saw you with it. You were actually <laughs> jealous of him saying that. <laughs> Well played, Crofty. <laughs> no, I didn't believe it. It has been bust, but I had to. At first, I thought I'm going to have to do this myself, but I ended up doing it with Jean Mickey. And it was all right. It was, it was, it's no making a bag, man, things like that. It's very. You met somebody. Because it's all hairy ass builders. No, I did I meet, I met somebody. And I met somebody, was at the Walter Smith thing. And, you uh, met somebody because Dee sent me the most weird message, man. He says, and it was a photo of you, man. And it was Ertzell. You and some geezer there. Ah, uh, that's. And he uh, said he, I was met in, him. he was in. He was in a house and I walked into it and you went, who is it, dearie? Uh, aye, yeah, that's right, aye. So, see that suit I was wearing, mm -hmm. right? It was a grey suit and I thought, I'm just going to wear this tomorrow night and all because I was going to the Walter Smith thing. Aye, aye. But of course, I ended up getting a half pizza supper with curry sauce and I dropped it all down my grey tap. And also, a group, my grey jacket, and also everybody was going, you going to that Walter Smith thing tomorrow? So I started to go, I can't wear this again because folk are going to go check him wearing the same suit. Uh, do you want to tell you? So... <laughs> 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 No, I went to East Slayers and I got my nice, I got a nice suit with a dicky bow Aye. and the waistcoat and all the rest of it, and I wore that and set up the night at the Walter Smith thing. Again, I was with Fletch and on the taxi Aye. on the way home, Stole half piece of supper it. again. I got wrecked it. That's two suits in one week, two suits down. Too, too hot. Do you know the definition of madness? It's a repetition. Doing the, same, doing the same, same thing, thing over and over again and yes. expecting different results. That's insanity. Yes. Is it? Aye. What? No, I wasn't, but... He texted me last night. He texted me last I, night? I, 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 and I was going to go... I, 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 and I was going to go, I wonder if he's only just texted me. <laughs> I'm sitting on my couch and it comes up on my phone. Super <laughs> Ali, and I'm like... No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> That's my head I was like, I think my home next is Super Ali. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I know, mate. But then I opened it, I was Did a you, bit... Aye, aye, aye. Hi, this is a communal text. Aye, exactly, I know. I was like... <laughs> a oh. communal text? I was like... But mate, I, I, I get added to a group to text the other day. A group chat for, uh, for Tam Cowan. Aye. Oh, see, now I feel bad. Did you, did you get put no, on I it? No, I don't get put on it, mate. I don't mind. Aye. <laughs> <laughs> so, football. <laughs> I know, sorry, Tom. Sorry, Tom, man, sorry. So, what's, what, what the hell, what the hell has happened? <sighs> What was right, the group chat? What was the group chat? <laughs> so basically, he was asking folk today's show. Oh, right, it was a good text, aye, right? Aye, aye. You don't get that. Mm. So I had a lot to see the folk that were in it. There's some big names, man. Who's in it? I don't want to say. No, you need to say now. Soon as Strachan, aye. Boyd, I don't know who's no one. Alan McCoyst. I don't know. That's the. Oh, I'm feel to see this in no, case it's no, no, this no, a bit of a neck, no. I don't want you to keep saying that. <laughs> just don't don't have no, that. Let's, let's, let's go to for I let's go to fight. No, we need not no we need let, come on, we need to talk about what's happening. Let, that's what we're gonna talk about, right? That's what we're gonna talk about. Right, so um on Saturday it was Celtic uh, Celtic away to Motherwell. Mm -hmm. Dramatic. Uh -huh. Dramatic last uh, five minutes of the match. Hey. I was a real seat listening to that on the radio, too. It's Aye. mental listening to it in the radio. I, I, I couldn't get over what was happening. Are you pure excited? The scenes, the, the scenes. I've seen the scenes at Ibrox, man. Me and Leo are sitting waiting and Tam and Bertie came in. They're like, everybody's like, I bet it's my age, mother. Just go two seconds, huh? It's two, man. <laughs> <laughs> and seeing you walking, seeing everybody walking up the stairs, they're all walking up like that. <laughs> then we had Hibernian nil, Dundee FC nil. Uh -huh. Then we had Kilmarnock won St Mirren won. Yep, McInnes has only won one league game this season. St Johnson won. Get him in, man. <laughs> Livingston won. St Johnson's second game in a row without, uh -huh. without losing hearts. Beat Ross County 1-0 away from home. Uh -huh. And at Ibrox. Oh. What happened, lads? A disaster. It was a catastrophe. See, mate, I thought they said they went to that game since so it was just the worst. Mate, it was, it was yeah. the worst. I've it no, was. I've not watched you this season. You text me going, you're absolutely shite, didn't you? No. That's a swear word again, man. I know, but I was, I was, it was quoting me. It was quoting me, that's all right. <laughs> it was bad, man. It was like... Aberdeen could have scored four or five. They could have, but... Oh. It's one of the man just sitting going like that, right? The only good thing you can take for us is surely he's got to get sacked tonight. <laughs> well, it was like that. It there was, there was even a photo of me when I was like, there was something that, he, that crossed my mind when uh, Seema scored. I went, oh, this could... Save him for Aye. a couple of weeks, I know. It's a weird oh. feeling, that, isn't it? Ah, it's no nice, man. You said you were raging when you scored. <laughs> 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 Sitting there when Seema scored. 
Hier naar Graats. Nu hebben ze iemand gekocht. Wat je doen? Wie ba? Wie ba? Stef, je bent zelf die schot again. Nou, wie schot? Nou, dat was de final nu. I mean, it's getting ridiculous now. Mate, I'm telling you now. We're in bad shape. Oh, we're in soapy bubble. I think. This could say us, but it's it's really really no funny. I mean, we're watching that game tonight again. I, I mean, it's just they need to take that dessert out the firing line. That boy needs and see llamas. <laughs> llamas is terrible, man. Oh, it's it, terrible, man. So bad. I don't. I don't know how we go for you. I mean, what manager's going to be sitting more? I think I'm going to apply for that job. Steve Bruce. <laughs> no, Mark Hughes. Neil Warnock. Aye. No, Billy Davis. Oh, Did you not Neil Warnock not just retire? You'd come out of retirement for Rangers, wouldn't you? I don't retire, they just resign. Aye. So I know you were making a fool of me for saying McInnes, right? But what I meant was, and it would have never happened, but I would have been happy with McInnes to steady the ship. But obviously, the wheels are in, were in motion to get Alex Ray in. The ship had wheels. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Alex Ray and Stephen Davis. Alex Ray's sitting behind Michael Beale getting forty He's taking on fine well, exactly what's happening. Karma, mate. Beale doesn't have Gio's in charge. No it, and it was at Aberdeen. So did. So did. And it was at right. Aberdeen. It was the Aberdeen game. Karma. It's a so, bitch. I know. And you might have heard Simon Jordan talking about it. Oh, mate, I did. He was, he was bang on, but see when they said about the managers that Rangers have employed, when you look back at it, you're going, what are they doing? Mm-hmm. Gerard worked out, right, fair enough. What Jordan said. It's a big risk. No, but I see this time, none of this project nonsense. See, get a manager in who has won titles, who knows how to win leagues. You need to go. You know, they're not ten a penny. No. No, I know, but, but David, that, that, that but, boy Clement, he's won two leagues with He just took a job last night. Clement, did he? Mm-hmm. Did he? I don't think he did. I don't think he did. Who's the one that took a job last night then? Aye, Saudi came Aberdeen. in. Aye. But you see, how much how how much does Brendan get? Brendan Rodgers get a year, is it something like three million? It's fucking, oh, it's, oh, it's, it's mad money. Ra- that's what Rangers need, mm-hmm. but mm-hmm. the thing is... You, you, only get, you get what you pay for. Ah, see, I the, the, the money we're spending on sacking, mm-hmm. getting new managers and you can spend it on an actual good manager. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But we're also spending on a good striker. <laughs> uh, we're, we're not, we're not going to get Potter. Well, no, the Galado guy as well. What's he still doing <laughs> for the Real? We're not going to get Galado, no. man. No chance he's he going He's not coming to Scotland. No. Aye. So it's going to it probably will Is that the River Plate manager? Aye. Mm-hmm. Everybody's going on about him, but we're not going to get him. I think uh, all the candidates I've seen mentioned, I would go with the boy, come on. Just what about, because... What about, what about Janssen? Pa- Pascal Janssen? Is it Pascal Janssen? Did he know... Again, he said a good, he said a good start with Altman, but I don't... I don't, I don't know. Did I just had a text there saying we've had a meeting with Van Nistelrooy. I knew we were going to do that, man. I knew. I said that to my mates the other day. But is that again a bit like, is that the sort of Lampard, Gerrard, hoping for? He went away, the, the reason he left PSV was he fell out with the board and all that, didn't he? Mm. Mm. Oh, no, no. So, and you want to take Lampard? No. I would maybe even at a push take McInnes before Lampard. <laughs> <laughs> and that's saying a lot about Lampard. You're but, actually serious, sir, when you're saying that? No, no. Mm-hmm. But would you argue, but... When he managed Chelsea the second time round, it was a shit show. Aye, it was, Everton's a, poison, a shit show. Aye, it was a poison charge, but it's but, even... But Rangers are a shit show. Aye. So, I don't know what's going to happen. See, speaking about Van Nistelrooy, I know you're talking about he fell out with the board, mm-hmm. but see, me like just purely his, his managerial stats, mm-hmm. he had a 64% win rate at PSV. Did he? Uh, 51 games, 33 wins, 10 draws, 8 losses. Now, oh, just, now, just purely based off, and I know stats don't tell the whole Is story. Is that domestic football? Uh, that's just his managerial record at PSV, so that'll include cups and all that as well, I'm assuming. Mm. Did uh, they win anything with him? No. There you go. There's an answer. How was the uh, Celtic game last night, too? I thought Celtic were great last night. Mm. To be honest with you, I thought they played really well. Um, sucker punch right at the end, obviously. Um, but... I've come to expect it. That Europe's just a free hit for Celtic Rangers. He's are rotten in Europe, aren't you? Nah, I was shite, man. Oh. Sorry, just... No, I'm being serious. I wasn't, I wasn't a dick. No. no. Very, very quickly, just to tie you back, sorry, just to correct myself, he won the KNVB Cup, which is their um, version Cup. of the FA Cup, uh, basically. The Holland Scotland Scottish Cup. The Holland the Scotland, Scotland Cup. Uh, and he also won the Johan Cruyff Shield, which is like the Community Shield, aye, so it's like the FA aye, Cup aye, winner, aye, the league winner, aye, so he won those. Aye. Just to correct myself. 
podcast. The podcast is taking a wee turn after we start talking about football. We're having a good laugh, aren't we? No, we need to talk about football. Aye. No one, I've got it. Do you know what I mean? It's. Let's are, talk about the cinch deal. He's on a bad, a weird, bad way, but like you said there, cinch, Scottish football, Neil Doncaster. Has to go. It has to go. See that? Uh, I don't even like to talk about it anymore. You get angry when you talk about Neil Doncaster. I do, mate. I do. Yeah. It, really, it really, really annoys me. I, I think it's because... Oh, aye, 100%. And it just shows you the drama in that game. Well, what I mean? look at, well, look at Saturday. Mm-hmm. But Hearts and Hibs. Mm-hmm. That's not going to be telly. That's a free o'clock kick-off. That's the it? fourth time in five Edinburgh derbies that it's not been on the telly. It is ridiculous. Mm-hmm. I'm not getting into it again. I'm not getting into it again. I want you again, Alex. Yeah, no. I love it when you... It's because it's so crystal clear what needs to be done. It's pure hot when he gets angry, isn't it? It's so... We need to take it to the streets. We need to take it to the streets. It's so... Uh, we know what we need to do. We need to take it to outside Hamden when there's a Scotland game on and get people to actually talk about it. Mm-hmm. People... And 90% of folk that go to Scotland games are only like a Rangers fans. So you'll get a, a decent... But is that, no banging in, is that no banging in the door of the SFA when it should be the SPFL? No? It's, uh, I'm it's not, n- no, but it, what I'm saying is Scotland fans are then... They're, they're all going to follow a Scottish team, right? See if you talk to a Motherwell fan, for even going back to when Hamilton won the Premier League, right? Mm-hmm. I think the derby should be on the telly, regardless oh, of what aye. derby it is. Aye, I agree. Edinburgh derby, Lanarkshire Dundee derby, derby, Dundee, aye, aye, Hamilton. <laughs> Aberdeen. <laughs> and back again. You know what I mean? Like, any one of them. You Give understand what I'm saying? Give us a song. You understand what I'm saying? Ah, I, I agree with you. I agree with you. I agree with you. I agree with you. I it just gets me angry because it's... He's well, rubbing his eyes. Like he's going to take a drink. They're their own worst enemy. They, it's as if they go out to deliberately kibosh any chance the Scottish game has got of getting itself to a wider audience. Aye, totally. It's, it's ridiculous, man. It yeah, really bang is ridiculous. On. Yeah, bang on. Just keep it to the clubs, man. Give keep it to, to the, the clubs. Get, give it to the clubs and let them do their own TV mm. deals. Mm-hmm. I know Scottish trip was in a state, but, but, but the the var thing way. Oh, uh, how annoying was hearing that guy going? Can't do anything, mate. Can't do anything. Oh, can't do it. Delay, delay the game. Delay the game. I mean, strap one on. Know. Stop the game. Mm-hmm. Can he mate? Deal with it. Everybody in the granny can. can, can he know, but the actual, needs... No, but the actual rule is once it's started, yes. you can't go back. But you got you try to tell me, but what's more important? A goal getting a perfectly good goal getting chopped off, or somebody going out the road and showing a wee bit of initiative and going, no, hold on, I know it's the rules, but that wasn't a goal. That, was a, that was a goal. See, that's the now. That's the rules, right? So there can be no blowback on it. Cops making noise about doing replays and all that. That's never going to happen, right? See, if that Spurs, can... if they then go back and allow that goal to stand, Spurs have actually got a case. Do you know what I mean? Because it, the rule is the rule. Yep, so it's, that's, that's not then a human error. Human error can be forgiven. Going back and actually... Aye. Doing something and breaking rules Aye. to accommodate something. He's is, not saying the rules right. Um, the that's rules not the, right. That's the what rule, I'm saying is, Spurs would then have a case to go. Well, wait a minute here. Aye, what's that? You know what the, 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 and then what, what do you do? Do you then analyse every single VAR decision? What a goal! Do you know what I mean? What it was a, a great finish oh. by Diaz. The only argument that you've got, I, I feel, with that is if there was no VAR, it was no goal. That's it. Because mm-hmm. the, the, the referees... But that's what it comes down to. They, they said, uh, count, the guy said count it on the audio, mm-hmm. and the referees heard mm-hmm. whatever the referees heard and made the on-field on, on decision. And the game's restarted so quickly, they've not mm-hmm. had a chance to put the lines up. Mm-hmm. So it's it's just a, it's a it's mess a up. It's a cluster flip, Donald Duck. It's a cluster uh, flip. Uh, no, I know, but I still think you're, you're, you're as well putting your neck in the line to, to stop... Somebody no getting a mm-hmm. goal rather than going, oh, we've broke a rule because we've stopped the game five seconds after it's restarted. I mean, it right, literally was five about, seconds. Right, but let's say somebody, a goalie saves a penalty, right. right? And then the game goes on, right? And it's, the game restarts. The ball goes out, a corner comes in, the game restarts, right? And then they go back and go like that. Oh, well, actually, if you look at that, his, he's come off the line mm-hmm. early, right? You can go back and look at that because... That's a genuine mistake by by the referee, but he's already actually like, spoken to to the VAR team, and they've they've came to the conclusion. Although there was crossed wires, the games then restarted after that so, VAR decision. So, so VAR has been used uh-huh. where it's meant to be used aye, for, but so, they've got it wrong. Aye, aye exactly. Aye. But see if it's like a penalty, and the the ball goes out and comes back in and whatever, and then they go back and look at VAR, 
and they say, all right, well, actually, that should be retaken mm. because but he was off the line. But they did go back and look at VAR, and uh, he said he's offside. Aye. aye, aye. It, well, aye. they didn't say he's offside. No, I didn't say he's offside, but it, they're saying It was just crossed wires. Aye, it was aye. purely human error. And do you know something what you said, Grado? If there wasn't any VAR, that goal wouldn't have counted. Right? Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. the argument here is that would have been a human error anyway. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Because if there say, wasn't aye, any aye, VAR. Aye, aye, aye. So like, I can understand Spurs, what Spurs you're saying. Spurs one, man. I know, but he's fucking, he's, he's cooking. He, he is, is cooking. He is, but did you watch that game? Liverpool were good, man. Were Liverpool good. were good. They were good. It's going to be, do you think Spurs easily finish in the top four? I think if they get a striker in January, they'll challenge for the title. They need a striker then now. Son's brilliant for the middle, know, man. But Son's class for the middle, I know, man. I know. He's class. I don't think they need a striker. But they then. definitely need a backup yeah, striker. Yeah, they need a striker. backup. But he's, oh, son is so I if they See if they get a, a, a good poacher. I right, see what Madison, eh, what Son and Kane were like together. Madison and Son have just. Do you know what they need to do, though? They need to get rid of Kulazewski. Right? Now, hear me out. Every I've watched every Spurs game this season, right? Mm. See when he gets the ball, he passes it back the way all the time. I think he's a handy and player. I know, but he's no playing the way. You can tell, like the 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 Spurs moves come to a grind and halt sometimes when he gets the ball. The Jenka Kulisevsky. I think he's all right. <laughs> Good, I'm glad you were you were looking at me in the distance there. You're totally. He's thinking, going. I might get off that too. Anyway, anyway, will we move on but to the rest of the results? Yes. Did, did Ange did Ange get a man, man, manager the month? Yes. He's near Kevin Muscat, but. <laughs> that, that, that man City sound shout isn't looking ah, so you, by the way. looking so stupid now by the way listen to you I don't know who you're talking to I'm he's, just saying he's we all, no I laughed as well we all laughed <laughs> you all laughed at me aye that's what aye, that's, that's what we meant that's, that's what we meant that, that, that was the right. thanks Grant so don't thanks, try to twist our words I was laughing at it as well uh, and he's all be laughing the other side of your face when he lifts that big cup what big cup European one he spoils next season. Mm. <laughs> hey, anyway. I'm no, I, I think he's doing an absolute unbelievable <laughs> job. I do I think he's class. I know. He's brown. Right, anyway, championship. I brought two. Inverness three. Oh. Inverness won a game. Oh, I'm having the iron there. Can't they won a game, man. Because the dunk effect, didn't it? Aye, the dunk aye, effect. Aye. Seven games. Big dunk turns up. Kicks behinds I wonder all if, over the dressing room. I wonder room. if dunk in... Dick, go to tap. Duncan Dick. Dick. Wrestle, Duncan Dick's. I'd be a good name for a wee fast food restaurant, wouldn't it? Duncan Dick's. Duncan Dick's. What are you selling? What? What are you selling? Duncan Dick's. It's like, it's like donuts. It's like, donuts. It's like, it's like, it's like <laughs> aye, and, and like sauce wanks. to dip them in. Wanks. <laughs> wanks. With, with different sausages aye. to dip them in. Uh, yeah, sauces, I mean. Aye. Come and get your links at Duncan Dick's. Duncan Dick's. Dick's. Copyrighted. <laughs> ah. Copyrighted. <laughs> Right, uh, Dundee United 4, Queen's Park 1, an mm. absolute hammering for mm -hmm. Queen's. Wraith 2, right, sorry, Air 1, Wraith 2. Martin 0, Airdrie 1, and Partick Thistle 3, then Fernwin 0. The Jags again. They're all in that league, man. That mm -hmm. league. Mm -hmm. Wraith yeah. Rovers are only a point behind Dundee United. Scottish Championship is one of the best leagues, man. Mm. It's unbelievable. It's hot. What's the game on Friday night? You must be gutted that you couldn't uh, stay in it, Ben. <laughs> Oh. I know you're practically in the junior leagues, man. Don't worry, mate. <laughs> Listen, if we're having a wee year out, ah. we'll be back. Ah. Or whatever. What did they call that again? A uh, sabbatical. 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 Oh. Right, what's going on here? League One, Ottawa One, Edinburgh One, Falkirk Three, Montrose Two. Kelly Hearts That's three. a bad result for Montrose, man. They've been all right as well. Ah. Saw them pre-season. They were no bad, by the way. They were two. They were two up. Aye. Well, you've been keeping tabs on them, have you? Uh, Kelly Hearts Three, Queen of South One. Sterling 2, Cove Rangers 2. When did Hamilton play, Ben? Uh, Hamilton played the Friday night. On the Friday night, right, uh, let's go back to the Friday. Do you want me to tell you or do you want to say? Uh, let me build you right, up okay, first, sorry, for God's sake. Sorry. Wait for your intro, Ben. Sorry, yeah, sorry. So on the Friday night, we had Hamilton versus Annan. Mm. The main event. Mm. What was the score, Ben? 5-0. <laughs> <laughs> we pumped. Simple Use as that. I love, I, I, as I, that. I love Ben's like pure. He's so, it, he's so happy. He's it's funny, but isn't it like, it's, like you, that, this is probably where you should just be because you're so happy. Do you I, know what I mean? I, Instead I, of being scunnered about getting bit every week in the, like, the really Premier League. Well, well, listen, when we came down for the Premiership, I was the first guy to say, listen, 
We'll win more let, games. Let, let's build a firm right. and enjoy we'll, ourselves. We'll win more games. You know, so we'll get more good players. Aye. Let's fight we guys. We'll, we'll, up. <laughs> we'll get to go on planes and all aye. that. <laughs> let, let's Do you know what I mean? Let's, let's fight with we guys at say Starbucks. Aye, aye. aye. But listen, no, like we can like get said, Crusaders in the Challenge Cup. Aye. Like I said, we eat it and we'll be back up the Championship next year. Don't worry about it. So, taking us on to League 2. Yes. Dumbarton 3, Stranra 1. One of Dumbarton. East 5 1, 4 for 1. Spartans 2, Bonnie Rig Rose 2. Stenhouse Muir 2, Clyde 2. Performance of the week, Peterhead 6. Oh. Elgin, zip. Wow. You don't so, want to play Peter Head, do man? They're riding across the waves, man. Well, they're top of the league. I know, that's what I said. I they're riding across like the waves. Like oh, they're being serious. They are doing well. Can't believe we're out there tonight, man. <laughs> 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 yeah, 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 you rascal. Oh, yeah, you rascal, you. Yeah. Cheeky. So that, that has been this week's Football Roundup. We interrupt this broadcast to tell you very important news. If you've been involved in an accident and it's not your fault, you need to call not your insurance company. G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G been running into the back yet a set of traffic lights when you've been ogling some bird's ass. Maybe you, had had that electric, maybe you had that electric motor that went out of control and had to get rammed into the back wow. of your quarters. Oh, oh my God. God. That, that was, wasn't his fault. It, it was the Tesla motors as well. It wasn't his fault. The car couldn't stop. The car couldn't stop. It was his fucking electric stop. It wasn't his fault. It wasn't his fault. Like we said, if it's not your fault getting touched touch on the coal, Al, Grant, Grant Greg, Beko, Ben, Jamja, Jamja, Moira, Moira, Aye, 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 and uh, you can get them on 01698767172. That's 01698767172. They'll give you a car that's the same as your car. They'll replace it. You can drive about that. In the meantime, well, it's in the garage. Like we said, like for like. So if you've got a belt or a motor, you'll get a belt or a motor. If you've got a shan or a motor, you'll get a shan. <laughs> well, 100% of your claims are going to you. Not at fault claims. Me, Jesus. One hundred, one hundred, one hundred, one hundred, one hundred percent of your claims. G four claims. G four claims. One hundred and four claims. Me, Jesus. Oh, by two. Right. Where else we been, man? I'm drinking. Raspberry. Oh, thanks by the way to the, the beer company that's Vault, Vault City. Vault, Vault City. City, thanks very much. I'm listening. drinking a can of raspberry, blueberry, bubblegum bottles. Thanks very much. I wish you didn't have the cold because I would well try not. There's plenty there. You send us loads of cans. I don't want the cold, Jack. can kill me. I don't, don't do it, Tom. I'll never do it. I'll never, I'll never do it. I'll never, I'll never let go, Jack. No, but I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> A big thank you to Vault City for sending them uh, sending us some cans. Whoa. Do you want to try it? Do you want my cold? No, I love it. No. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Andy, but my, my don't cool. think don't think that's a slight on your beer. He's got the cold. I've got my beers in there. Do you want to taste my cooties? Oh thank you. <laughs> no, okay. Right. Right. What's oh. been what have we been doing then? Um, Any thoughts about current scenarios and situations and such like? I got tickets to go and see Tenacious Day again. Oh, so oh. they're playing next year, aren't they? Mm-hmm. Better yeah. bits. In the hydro, nice man, nice hydro for the day. Do you love them, don't you? I've, I've uh, been on stage with him a couple of times. Have you been on the stage with him a couple of times? Yeah, and smoke so, uh, hung a bit, hung a bit, with, hung a bit with Jack Black backstage. How did you wrangle that, mate? I was standing at the front, right? You're and I never, I never got no, I never go to the front of the crowd because did you have your for obvious hair at that point? No, no, I was wearing a baseball cap, oh, right? So, uh, I was shouting for him to chuck me a plectrum, Jack. Jack. <laughs> Jack, 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 can I have a plectrum? Right, but he said to me, what is it you want? I said, it's a plectrum. He says, oh, a pick. And I didn't know what a pick was. I was like, no, a plectrum. Oh, does that... And he went like, what's a plectrum? I says, just let me come up and sing a song with you. I don't know why I Where said that. Where was this? And uh, no footage in and this. The, in the QMU. And they could hear you in the bother. How many folk were there? Like seven? It was a QMU. It's <laughs> tiny. Ah, it's a wee intimate tiny. How could he hear you? Like, I was right at the very front. Like, what, for me to Stevie away mm-hmm. from him. Aye. Right, so... He, he's like, ah, right. He says, You want to sing a song with a D? Wow. And I says, Aye. He says, Well, that sounds like a fucking challenge. Yeah, wow. sure. He actually said that, so that swear doesn't quote. count. Aye, that's, that's a, a quote, quote right? Aye, aye. So I got up and I was like, What song am I going to sing? I, I had no idea. I, I just went like, uh, Do you know how to play Sweet Home Alabama? 
and uh, Kyle just started playing Sweet Home Alabama and I sang it. Nice, right? Let's hear it. And then they, it gets better, right? So they came back years later mm -hmm. and I was it was in Aberdeen, the mm -hmm. Aberdeen Exhibition Centre. No, it wasn't. It was in the Corn Exchange in Edinburgh. And I walked in and this guy in a suit came over to me straight away and they're like, can I speak to you for a minute? Took me to the side and I was like, hiya. He's like, uh, I'm Tenacious D's manager. Do you want to go up and sing with him again? Right? So they made a big, like, oh, as if it wasn't planned, one of the ones. He's mm -hmm. like, so where's that little fucker who likes to ruin the show? Wow. And I knew, uh, I got, <laughs> That's good, isn't it? I get crowd soft for the back to the front <laughs> and up on a stage. Mate, legit, honest to God. All right, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> honest to God, I was up to my knees in clunge that night, man. <laughs> was that all your granny's butt? <laughs> did, he, did he bring you some comics from America? <laughs> no, <laughs> uh, he, he, took me, he took me to WH Smith and bought me shooting match. <laughs> So anyway, that's so, one. No, no, that, that, that is cool. So, but see when you were... He said so, the first one. He said the Dalai Lama came out of The first... By the way, I've got a story like this about Snoop Dogg and all. So, that, but I've got photos to... Well, I've got photos to back up with Tenacious D one as well. See, as when you were, see when you went to Tenacious D in Aberdeen, <laughs> were you sitting in the... Were you in somebody drive you up? It was a corner exchange. It was in the water. It was in Edinburgh. Were you just hanging all the way up? Oh, if remember me, wonder if they remember me. Do you know what, listen, I never even thought of that. No. I'm not joking. The second I walked in the door, a guy took me to the side. And so after the, so it, the manager's just stunned about looking for you? No, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, mate. And by the way, I know, I know, the that, I know that these stories sound made up. I know that they do. Hey, hey, Chad, go out to the door and see if the little fucker turns hey. up. I mean, he's hey. only got a pure busy day hey. managing a band, but he's stunned out. Hey, looking for tools. Steve, yeah? Go get me a midget. <laughs> oh, it's tall. Oh. It's all right, I can see it. I have it still, Watch man. That's filth, man. I can see it. I don't like that, man. Right. I was like, 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 that's a God's honest truth. That, that story is a true I story. And the second time at the corner exchange, I went backstage. I went backstage <laughs> and I was I was singing a book with them backstage. They were, they were sound as. So, how did, how did Snoop Dogg scout? How did he get you? <laughs> right, so, we were in the uh, academy, right? Snoop Dogg was, uh, it was his gig, Snoop Dogg, we were at. And there was a big guy, a, right, a, a big black guy who was about six foot five, tall and wide, right? Mm. Massive. It was obvious he was a bouncer or, or one of the security. Is he looking at Fiona? And I went like that to him. I just went like that to him and nudged him. Just give him the wink. I, it's me. Yeah. No, I, Jack, I nudged Jack, pal. <laughs> 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 so I went like that to him. I went, here, big man, me and you could put on a better show than this kid and on. Mm. And he went, why don't you tell that to dog? <laughs> oh, what do we do? Hold on. I just, I'm just starting to, like, what? Tell it to the deal, double G, brother. Come on. Basically, that's Just what like it's like. Right? It's as easy as that. Now, you, now, listen, you know in the academy, the women's toilets are next to the stage. Right, that's right, aye. Right? So, he took, he took me, he took me down to the front. I'm tired, right? he, took, he took me down to the front, right? And we walked we walked in between the stage and the crowd, right? During the show? During the show. And I shit you not. <laughs> listen to me. Right, right, listen to me, right? Snoop Dogg went like that. In the middle of a song. Hey, yo, what's up, little man? Right, I'm not kidding. And then aye. he took me backstage. I watched the rest of the concert on the stage, like at the sidelines. In right? the wings. Right, in the wings. And then after it, I went back and Snoop Dogg and I had a wee, a wee, a wee cigarette, a wee, wee cigarette together. Smoked it down at the beef with him. So speaking about cannabis. <sighs> oh, oh so so hey. Hey. Wait, wait, to, uh, I do believe you, it's just funny. No, mate, I've got photos of me and Snoop backstage and all that. <laughs> Would you I have? I'll show you. Oh, I know you have seen it. Calm down, mate. Right, that's the thing, mate. I've got to take a job with you again. <laughs> I'm fed up with us. Do you know what I need? I need to calm down. Do you know what helps me calm down? CBD oil Scotland. Yes, yes. Now, where's this? Where's this giveaway thing? Why don't you tell it to the dog? I was talking to Barry. Right. Barry. Uh -huh. It's coming down here next week Brilliant. when we're recording. Right. He's putting together a hamper. People are going to think he's made up. I know. I like your stories. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you something. <laughs> hey, can I just say something here? Yes, <laughs> yes. My stories are 100%. Uh, no, I, 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 can, oh, I believe you. You just get 40s, mate? No, I said, I'm a 60s. You get 40s? 
Ray Afi chat GBT. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I love the fact that folk will never actually know if they are true or, or, I or made up. Aye. Aye. I do, honestly, I do believe Aye, it. so they are. Aye, 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 I do Or should you? No, but CBD Oil Scotland. I was talking to Barry the other day. He's going to bring the hamper down here next week where we will start our CBD Oil Scotland giveaway competition. Bro, but in the meantime, get yourself on the CBD yes. Oil Go there and you can get yourself a wee discount. 30% is the discount if you use the code. Yes. CBD30. Which is here on the screen, I think. Yes. Di- might, might be down there. And also, also we're getting to that time of the year, guys. What's coming up? Panto. No, before that. Halloween. Fireworks. Fireworks, right. Now, fireworks. my dog is terrified of fireworks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. One of them's terrified of fireworks, one of them isn't he? One of them's terrified of the wind. The other one, isn't he? Yes. So, if your dog's up to high door, Cam the Bang, right? Cam yeah. the Bang is on screen now, Benko. Cam the Bang is on screen yes. now. It is cannibal if your precious little pets are scared you know, of the bang. it's banks. funny, I've never had a dog that was scared of fireworks. Like, do you know, but I've always heard and other folks... have had a lot of dogs. I've had a lot of dogs, right, man, right. and it's weird that I've never ever... They're your short dogs, but no. Uh, no, but no, there was my auntie Isabel's uh, dog, Benji. He was always, I'm sure he was fearing Um But that's a great product, isn't it, for, for Bonfire? Because I do know that that's a big, massive thing. Aye. I mean, you hear dogs taking heart attacks mm. and stuff like that. I was talking to Barry and he said a, a woman came out of the shop and the dog had a wee sign on saying anxious dog. Mm-hmm. And it's absolutely... <laughs> Have you never seen the wee signs? You're sick, man. No, I've no, no. What about when you get anxious? Jane, no, I know. No, listen, my dogs go anxiety. My Aye. dog self harms. You no, know what I'm not living with you. You actually. Bo- <laughs> 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 well, here's my daddy. All right, Claude. Hey, <laughs> hey, you got a good. The minute he done that, Claude's out in the corner. Hey, you got you got a full roast beef instead of the next. Because I made an arse. I made an arse. He said he get beef. He get Yorkshire pudding. He get mashed tatties, he get cauliflower cheese. Mm. Speaking so of I don't heart attacks. My my <laughs> <laughs> I don't mistreat the dog. He needs to get his cholesterol checked. <laughs> I know. Oh, yeah. Anyway, calm the band, caramel, right. right? If you're coming up to this season, we've got fireworks, getting off, left, right. It's really bad. Right. It's bad for dogs. So, caramel, get that for CBD Old Scotland, and I can testify it works because I used it on when he moved to us. I'm just glad Rangers only doing well in Europe now because when you went to. The final in Seville every mm. Thursday night. There was fireworks going off. Aye, aye, they were good. Cold, it's funny that, the good days, man. Mm. Aye, aye. But tell us a bit more about CBD Oil Scotland. So, CBD Oil, as you know, I'm a huge advocate yes. of it. CBD Oil Scotland is, without a doubt, the best one that I've tried. Mm-hmm. Uh, no ifs, buts, or maybes. Ran by lovely people who are in the business purely mm-hmm. to help you out. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, you, where are you going to get a 30% discount? No. Do you know what I mean? You yeah, don't yeah. get that. It's mm-hmm. 5, 10, 15 at max. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So a 30% discount. Passing off the savings to yourself yes. for anything that you need from the website. CBD30, get it in mm-hmm. your cart. Muscle pain, it anxiety, yep. the lot. Check out CBD Oil Scotland. It's there or there, like Toll said. I don't know. And remember, 30% off if you use the code CBD30. And by the way, 30. we do know that a lot of you have been using it. Yes, we do. Because know. we can see. We can see. We, we can know see. Who it is. Is. Yeah. We know who you are. Yes. CBD Oil Scotland. Listen. You know what? I miss Bonfire Night for me used to be oh, mate, it was a big deal, WrestleMania man. for me. Did you love fire, fire no, because you were not, working in the, the fire brigade? It was that was a that Aye. was a that was a gig of the year. Was that like first night at the proms? Aye, it was. Was the phone going up constantly? Up the game. Well, you know, in, in the room it goes. It was a nine nine call, so they would turn the off because it's just constant. Did you not have a big team meeting before that? Going right, boys, this could be a big time, you know, man. We Aye, leading up to you. I'm sure this what is the night in here. <laughs> 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 a bit like that. <laughs> but what always happened? What always happens was that there would always be officers coming in, like be taking it on fire. Like Somebody shot maybe no, a rocket. No, that's no. That, it, would, it would be a bit, it would be a bit annoying because obviously it's like hard graft, and like you'd mm. have these big officers, big militant officers coming around with like a box of celebration. Like, Sweetie, you know what I mean? <laughs> and they hang that guy through your shirt. Oh man, just stay calm, stay calm. Aye, aye, aye. This woman's hell's in fire. Aye. Get that aye. box of celebration. Face. It was not so, but always surprised me. Oh, I'd like to put a bonfire. Yeah, it was bonfire night. Aye, aye, aye. It's in my living room. You can't be too. 
Aye. 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 But anyway, do you remember going to school? Right. Remember I got to school when it was close to fireworks? Aye, he can rock, rock his shot at you. in the corridor. Aye, aye. in the school, not oh. in corridors. <laughs> Bang, aye. Oh, I was petrified, man. I was petrified. Oh. I've never set off a firework. Have you not? Have you not? Not to fear. Seriously? No, never done it. It's always got my brother to do it. I've never done it. I remember my dad used to get the... I don't even like touch the, sparklers. My dad used to get the, like, the... See the... Sparkles are alright. <laughs> sparkles are quite dirty. Why do you know that? <laughs> my wings <laughs> want sparkles. What are you talking about? <laughs> Well, oh. I can't let me hold a sparkler once. Aye. Aye, he's Give grabbed the wrong end, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! Aye. My dad used to get the big industrial boxes Aye. with the Russian instructions. <laughs> <laughs> the ones that go, just go bang, The ones bang, that you expect bang. Homer Simpson to buy. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, I told yeah. you last year, remember? I invited everybody up, remember? It's my fireworks. My Aye. bonfire night. Aye. I'm not naming the guy, but he's like, oh, many, he's, he's, cool. he's like, look, Stevie. I've got it, I've got it bad boys, just call Aye. me, right? I'm not right in the bottom, mate. Pure dark web numbers. Go close to him, man, do that lane. Got him off, guys. It's, it's, like, it's, like, it's like De Niro only seen it in the Goodfellas. No, just down there, down there. No, down, seen it can, go down there, go down there. That one. I'm going down, I'm going down the wee lane, no, no, no. no For fireworks? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you... but these were the bad boys, right? Allegedly, right? So, you've been at my house, big park at the bottom, right? Neighbours up here sent them off, man. I'm like, ah, they're good ones, but he's, he's, <laughs> every, everybody in my granny's came to my gaff, right? Pure star, ah, shh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See that guy, see when that happens? Aye. You're feared to go over there, aren't you? Oh, exactly. It's has got to just start combusting. So, so I'm like, ah, the ass always had to get the next one out and get the big one out. Pure big belter, man. <laughs> Pants in, man. Look there at the neighbours. You see this one? <laughs> I'm like, ah, man. I'm, I'm, he'll remain nameless because he's a good guy, but I'm phoning him going, what, what was that? I just gave you like two tonnes for them, man. What was that? What are you talking about, man? Did you actually phone him? I had I, I speak to him quite a lot. I'm like, come on, what are you doing? Mate, he's you're like, pure. I got it. I was raging, man. You pure, you pure celebrate every thing. I'm a mate. Pancake mate, day and all that, mate, and like you, you, you see, honestly, right, no, he is. He's a proper dad. He is, mate. mate you, you, you know my upbringing. <laughs> right. Don't bring us no, up, man. No, but I'm just saying, mate. Beep. Listen, you just Beep. want to give your kids what? a better right. upbringing just, than you had yourself. I, I just want to give them what I didn't have. Exactly. Okay, Christopher, that's exactly. It. So I'll overcompensate. Shout out to Chelsea at Bob's Moor, who's still alive. We'll probably find out about this at our work. Well done. Obviously. <laughs> What's that? There's no Yugoslavia anymore either. No, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Any holidays for you? <laughs> On the plane, man, it means morning. <laughs> See what I had today, man, did you? Get a bus to Yugoslavia, it's down a fucking tent. <laughs> no, but you're good at what you do. By the time you, we I'll, left I'll the country, was not there anymore? <laughs> 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 no, but I did we day celebrate everything, you're right, mate. Uh, you're, you're good at that. I did shout out to Nicola, she's the one that organises it all, but mm. I mean, she's good that way. Uh, <laughs> uh, things like that biff me, I mean, every kid, one of the years it was Halloween and then my foot had plenty of bags. And then they run out. I know one of them because it's Grado's house. Well, all the wings are going to go to Grado's house. It was a bit so I then had to jump in the motor. They never come to my house, man. Draw the motor, and then I was buying boxes of celebrations, (laughs) miniature heroes. Then they ran out. Then I ate them all, and I had to go back (laughs) and buy them. Then it was a case of. Lights off, draw the blinds. Aye, no, 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 there's a hide, certain hide, hide behind the cu- There's the, the a certain cushion. time where you go right. Enough's enough. Aye, right. I mean, let's wrap this aye, time. aye, get the blinds shut. Turn the lights off. But especially mate, if you've got a wee and like Perry, you know what I mean. You don't want the door going every five minutes. Who's saying the same thing kind of that you've got? So I remember me and me and my pals went to this old woman's house once for Halloween, and she answered the door. And she had no legs. <laughs> why is that funny, Ben? And she and she says, "Morning." <laughs> Ben, why is that funny? Can't start a story by going away to women's And then she asked you, "Where Were you confused? Is that a costume or what?" <laughs> well, no. She just wanted to lift, to lift her up Did to get just, a cup out of couple. She, she just needed a piss. <laughs> I'd say. That's horrific. That's pretty. Maybe, maybe we went in there, and honestly, I'm no joking. We done like a half an hour show for her. <laughs> What, what, what kind no, of, is this before no, you were in the biz? I know, mate, so, I was away. I'm not a child star. I'm not a child star. Yeah, but you're a community warden, yeah. 
No, honestly. Don't you be going down there tonight, Mate, it's, it's, like, it's like thing with Sandy, uh, Sammy, dare play. Uh, dare play? <laughs> dare play. Dare we play. guys, dare play for me. <laughs> and honestly, we were in there, I would say the best, the guts are 45 minutes. And she gave us 20 pence no, each. What, 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 what? <laughs> Didn't even get a biscuit, not even a, fucking, not even a penguin bar or nothing. And I toppled her over. <laughs> Aw. What kind of show did you do? Well, obviously I didn't matter a bit, but I can't do anymore. Because he's cancelled the guy. The guy that used to like oh, me. Right, so uh, I was yeah. doing him. Oh, uh, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> His surname rings with shitter. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of beasts, Aye. what about the... Speaking of beasts? Yeah. <laughs> What about the what about the trailer for the? He just started a story with a bump in his legs, and you're going uh, speaking of beasts. Aye, but hang about hang about it. Uh, have you seen the trailer for the the Jimmy Savile thing? Oh, oh wow. uh, Steve Coogan. Oh. That's uncanny, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Mate, that I've, is uncanny. I've, I've drove by his house about seventeen times. <laughs> Honest to God, see you're a glutton for punishment oh, this no. week, aren't you? Uh, but, and it's back to being spray painted again. Is it? Aye, uh, it's getting. Uh, That's all right, Jim will fix it. <laughs> 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 Pun in the night, pun in the night. Oh, oh, that was by the way, I know you're taking a note that, but just to let everybody know, I haven't let this been for what I've been driving by. <laughs> let you know, man. Jesus. You don't know when it's thinking you're driving by for fun, don't worry about it. <laughs> Snooting about for a note, you tell me. Oh, no, I know, it's happening. Do I drive by some Get it, get it. <laughs> Looking for an old broadband bill. <laughs> James Savile. Tiscally broadband. Sell it. Look at these letters, Mr. J. Savile. Oh, man. That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> BT sell net. Safeway's Sony fucking Ericsson. club membership, man. <laughs> I bet Dixon's bags are in the hall. Capital. <laughs> Freeze me. Oh, my God, man. <laughs> Oh, Christ. Anyway, thanks for listening to your painting. Catch you next week, Twitch.